Here are the starters for the 12th. Number one, want to guess again, owned by Hunt Harness Horses, Vernon Shire Stable, R&D Samson Stable, and Brian Penske Stable, trained and driven by Brian Penske. Two is T.E.'s Cool Spring, owned by T.E. Hare Jr. of Brownstown. John Woodley trains. It is Tim Tietrich in the bike. Number three, Fox Valley Francis, owned by Fox Valley Standard Breads of Sherman, trained by Tony Alanya, Dale Heitman driving. Number four will be Lucy Desiree, owned by John Nessa and Forrest Shoemaker of Altamont, trained by John Nessa, Eric Ledford in the bike. Number five, Lady McIntosh, owned by Stan Miller of Etna Green, Indiana. He trains, Sam Widger drives. Number six, Kenan's Doris, owned by Ken Spurlock of Dyer, Indiana. Trained by Mark Uricki, Ross Leonard, driving. Number seven, Chi Chi Wiz, owned by Ed Miller, Dean Derbyshire, and Mystical Marker Farms. Trained by Irvin Miller, Andy Miller in the bike. Number eight, Fox Valley Platinum, owned by Hotspur Partners, Limited Liability Corporation of Waterford, Wisconsin. Trained by Nelson Willis with Dave McGee in the bike. Nine is DLJ Direct, owned by Herbert Anderson of Sherrard and Brent Johnson of Big Rock. Trained by Herbert Anderson, Tony Morgan is the driver. And Colin Me Feisty, number 10, owned and trained by Don Nolan of Harvard, Illinois, the driver, Brent Holland. Post time, six minutes. Problems for Kenan's Doris behind the gate way back off the gate after being rough gated. They're off and pacing, DLJ direct for the lead, Lady McIntosh in between horses, joined by Fox Valley Francis and T.E.'s Cool Spring down toward the inside. Heading to the first turn, there goes Sam Widger moving up quickly on the outside with Lady McIntosh around Fox Valley Francis who dives over toward the inside and settles into second. T.E.'s Cool Spring is racing in the third position, then DLJ direct, followed by Lucy Desiree, want to guess again, and then comes Chi Chi Wiz, racing by the quarter. Fox Valley Platinum is behind her, then Cullen Me Feisty, and a long way back to Kennan's Doris last. 28 seconds was the time for the opening quarter. Fox Valley Francis moving up on the outside to challenge Lady McIntosh for the lead. DLJ Direct moves up behind them in third. Outside of T.E.'s Cool Spring. Gap of three to Lucy Desiree. Want to guess again. And then Chi Chi Wiz who takes toward the outside. Ten lengths from the front. Fox Valley Platinum behind her. Then Cullen Me Feisty and Kenan's Doris the distant trailer. The half in 56 and two. Lady McIntosh still leads it by a half length. Now DLJ Direct draws alongside. T.E.'s Cool Spring moves up in third around the outside of Fox Valley Francis, who's been shuffled back to fourth. A gap of two more lengths to Lucy Desiree. She comes off the rail fifth. She's racing four lengths off the lead. Chi Chi Wiz is behind her, outside of one, I guess, again, then Fox Valley Platinum and Cullen Me Feisty. At the three quarters, DLJ Direct draws alongside of Lady McIntosh. T.E.'s Cool Spring goes three wide. Three quarters, 125 and four. Fox Valley Francis buried toward the inside. Lucy Desiree, five wide off the far turn, moving by the eighth pole. They're being led by Lady McIntosh, a wall behind her. Lady McIntosh by three. Fox Valley Francis, then calling me feisty from way back, and Fox Valley Platinum from way back, but it's too late. Lady McIntosh has their measure. Lady McIntosh wins it. Fox Valley Platinum came on the grandstand side for second, and Cullen Me Feisty was third in 155 and two. The Illinois State Fair Colt Stakes consolation for two-year-old pacing fillies is official. The winner is owned and trained by Stanley Miller of Etna Green, Indiana. He also bred this Armbro McIntosh filly, and Sam Widger has his second win of the day. Number five, Lady McIntosh. Marcia Martinez of the staff of the State Journal Register makes the presentation of the trophy to Mr. Widger and Mr. Miller. And Miss Martinez has been the staff writer from the sports department with the State Journal Register for the last two years now that has covered harness racing at the Illinois State Fair and has done a tremendous job as well. Marcia, good to have you with us again this year. Lady McIntosh, the official winner, 5-8 on the exacta, $33.40.